Jesus taught his disciples many things. Interestingly, he had a lot to say about leadership. Take the Pharisees, for example. They loved the place of honor at banquets. They loved the most important seats in the synagogues. They loved to be greeted at the marketplaces. And they especially loved people that called them rabbi. Meanwhile, some of the other disciples were planning to lead the future church. So I was thinking, when the time comes for me to lead the church, I should let the people call me Rabbi. What do you think? Sounds very nice of you. But you are not to be called Rabbi. For you have one master and you are all brothers. Yep. Okay, so I guess Rabbi is out. This is a better plan anyways. I'll be a father to the church. Yeah, Jesus is always talking about how God is Father. He'd love us to use that title in the church. not call anyone on earth father. For you have one father and he is in heaven. Oh, hey Pete, is, is something wrong? Uh, no, no, nothing. Nothing. Okay, you can't be rabbi, you can't be father. What title are you going to use? I know, Jesus can't object to this title. I'll be a teacher for the church. <laughs> Nor are you to be called teacher, for you have one teacher, the Christ. Oh, come on! <laughs> oh, name, we got big name tags! I think I'm going to have to rethink what it means to be a leader a bit. The greatest among you will be your servant. For whoever exalts himself will be humble. And whoever humbles himself will be exalted. 